Kilbane Pryor, the walking apocalypse himself. You can't help but wonder how the Stillwater Butcher can't compete. I'll tell you, Zach, this psycho is a complete whack job. You know, when he came out of the womb, this guy literally choked out the doctor with his own umbilical cord. He's that fucking sick. I'll be ringside, keeping luchadors off your ass while you finish Kilbane. Good luck, man. Well, there it is, Bobby. The Saints receiving no love here. Not at all. It is raining hate down where they are, and of course it is. After what their capo did to Stillwater, they're lucky the fans aren't knifing them on their way to the ring. Wait, oh my god, look at that. It's Angel de la Muerte. Angel de la Muerte, the second half of a pale riders, sometimes regarded as the herald of a walking apocalypse. The youngest wrestler to ever win the Super K Cup is here in the Steel Court Arena. History is writing itself tonight, Zach. After his questionable loss to Kilbane years ago, Angel dropped off the face of the earth. If you're a fan of Murder Brawl, this is shaping up to be the best night of your life. Let's get the crowd going. All right, here we go. And here's the Butcher of Stillwater, Swagger at end. And speaking of surprises, here comes the Luchadors in force. The Butcher getting some help from the fans. This has just turned into a Lumberjack match from hell. All right, Bobby, you know, this is a classic matchup. Speed versus power, youth versus age, brains versus brawn. Well, you know, the fact that these two are tag team partners really adds another layer to the whole dimension. They train together. They know what to expect. One wrong move can end the entire... Hold that thought, Bobby. The Luchadors are on the side of the ring again. Don't think I'm forgetting what we were talking about, Bobby. You know, you're right, Bobby. The last time these two fought, Angel lost his mask to Kilbane, the greatest mark of shame in the Lucha Libre world. It's been years that had to be eating away at him. Oh, my God. Now Angel is out of the ring. I can't believe this, Bobby. This is punishing to watch. The Luchadors are manhandling Angel. This is sick. He's getting kicked around like a sack full of dead puppies. Oh, geez. Wait, the Butcher of Stillwater is making his way towards Angel. How much can one person be expected to... Oh, my God! A chainsaw! What the f***? <laughs> I hope the audience brought some paper bags, Bobby. It is raining blood. A fatal flaw in the Luchador's plan, Bobby. They didn't account for the murder brawl chainsaw. Oh, my goodness! Look at the blood fly! I could have had a V8. It was a desperate move for a desperate time, but it looks like the gamble has paid off. It's got to be getting slick on that floor. Hey, I got to get my grandma to get the mop. Look how far that spray went. Towel, please. Now, this is what people came here to see. The Butcher of Stillwater on an unstoppable rampage. Kilbane can't be happy to see this. I think I broke my leg. Get in there and kick that bastard's ass. I can hold off these jobbers. Well, it looks like people are going to see the fight they paid for as the Butcher of Stillwater stands toe-to-toe -to -toe with Kilbane. Now, this is classic Saints tactics. Use someone to weaken up the opponent that swoop on him for the kill. I already beat your champion. Now, kneel before the walking apocalypse. I'm not leaving here without your fucking mask. When I'm through with you, you'll be begging for me to kill you. This is it, folks. Two giants in the field of destruction facing off for our entertainment. Does it get any better than this? No, it doesn't. Though only one of these two has the good sense to leave the violence in the ring. Let's all remember how the Stillwater Butcher got the name. And here comes the kill speed. He dodged it. Here comes the reversal. Look at the brutality from the Butcher. I think you'd have to be naive to believe a giant like Kilbane hasn't thrown in a few punches here and there outside the ropes, Bobby. Not like the punches being thrown in here tonight, Zach. Both of our contenders seem to be out for blood. 
Cubing isn't bowing down to the butcher anytime soon. But this celebrity of the streets isn't making it easy on Kilbane. There seems to be something more going on than two world-renowned titans wishing to settle who rules the mountaintop. No matter who wins... Oh, my God! And Kilbane goes sailing out of the ring! But wait! He's already heading back in! Looks like the Stillwater Butcher isn't getting a moment's rest tonight. That's right, Zack. There are no free rides against the walking apocalypse. You betcha. Let's hope we get to see some bludgeoning. Kilbane winds up. Another miss from Kilbane. The champion cannot be happy with that one, Zack. Stick with you. Go, Rose. There he goes. Unbelievable. All's fair in love and murder, bro. Cubane's knocked out again. And here come the luchadors in his place. Murder Brawl is certainly giving the finest and blood gushing, bone mashing entertainment tonight, Bobby. My heart goes out for the cleanup crew on this one, Zach. Give it up while you can still walk. You won't forget how insane. Another kill switch. Unbelievable! Another reversal! This is incredible! The Killbane just can't connect with the kill switch. Kilbane, we're going nationwide. No! Oh, oh wow! It's shades of Angel de la Morte as Kilbane has been demasked. Yes, we have seen the face of the walking apocalypse. And to be honest, it's a man with the receding hairline. It's just a match. It's my fucking reputation! This is my city. I am it, Caesar! Oh. And I get to fiddle while it burns. <laughs> <laughs>